Welcome back, you wild and woolly Vikings. This is Julie1961 for Old Gamers Never Die, and we are back on Valheim for the next episode in our search for the Iron Sledge of Awesome. We are going to go through the process. We're going to go over Haldor's five rules. Remember those? First, build in the lee of the swamp. I'm going to go over my base here behind me. Never go into the swamp at night. Take a poison resist potion. Eat something before you go into the swamp and make sure you bring a hoe. I'm looking forward to this. It ought to be a lot of fun. We're going to go get our items that we need for Haldor so we can build this wonderful sledge as we follow his five rules to stay safe while we're doing it. So sit back, relax, join me in this adventure as we search for the pieces and parts to put the iron sledge together as we explore the swamps and hopefully <laughs> stay alive long enough to get everything put together. If you enjoy this video, make sure you hit the like button. I really do appreciate all the likes that people have been putting on my videos. Also make sure you leave a comment if you see something that you've got a question about or you particularly enjoyed or maybe you didn't enjoy. And also if you would like to subscribe to my channel, that would be awesome. Really would appreciate it. It helps the channel grow. Just make sure you hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll know every time I upload a new video to old gamers never die with that let's get this puppy started Okay, so uh, yeah, I'm not on the boat anymore <laughs> Things went poorly for our first adventure yeah, turns out the swamp is not a nice place and there's a lot of mean things there. Things that want to kill you as soon as you get off your boat. Things that would just as soon eat you alive. Things that want to poison you. Things that make it really difficult to just get on land. So I'll say if you're heading into the swamp for the first time, maybe be prepared like I was the second time because you know this place that you see around me right now that's from your second attempt <laughs> yeah the first one didn't work out well and the second one didn't work out great either but what I ended up doing was after <laughs> losing my boat once and then I was losing it again deciding that the best thing to do is do something similar to what I did with the dark forest, which is build a location close to the new area that's not actually in the new area. Because this game does outfit you with the things you need to go to the next level and be ready to take on the challenges of it and fight the bad guys and do the things you need to do. But you need to kind of put a toe in the water and step in. I mean, you can go ahead and spawn in all your stuff and walk in there like you're 10 foot tall and bulletproof, but what's the fun in that? I like to play the game and playing the game means leveling up as you go and learning new skills as you go. And frankly, the thing I learned is Swamp is not a nice place. Not at all. Yeah, so, you know, you got your meadows and you got your boar and gray dwarves and things like that out there. And you get the forest, which you got more of the gray dwarves and the trolls. And as you learn how to take those out, then that's cool and you can run in there. But swamp's a different beast. And I'll show you some strategies that helped me out getting into the swamp, why I started the base where I'm at, what I did to make sure that I could stay safe while I was there. And believe me, I'm not foolish enough to think I'm 100% safe yet. So far, the trolls that have spawned have knocked this house down once. I'm sure they can do it again, just given the opportunity. But I think we're relatively in a better spot now. The first house we built was out of wood and Basically, the only protection I had was a moat and ways to shoot out the windows here. Well, trolls didn't necessarily care about the moat. They walked right over it. You know, the one, the one with the big tree that he swings like a baseball bat and just decimates everything. Yeah, he knocked this whole thing down. So I decided that since I had gotten to the point where I could build in stone, I'd at least build the bottom part in stone and put some workshops here. So if you hop down here real quick, you can Take a look at the workshop I've got built. We've got our hearth with a cauldron, some cooking spots. Uh, I've got a portal so I can get here without having to go use a ship every time. I've got my stone cutter. I got my workbench. I've got my forge and working on upgrading that. 
So we'll make this a nice cozy little home. And right over here is the swamp. And I mean, right over here is the swamp. <laughs> Yeah, I can get out on these rocks and as soon as I get to that one in the distance there, the third one, the weather turns bad, rain starts, everything gets dark and I'll tell you, nothing beats a moat. And here's one thing I'm going to try to do. I don't know if they're still over here. They were here a little while ago. Yeah, there they are. So I got some leeches that I kited in here and if they're out here and the great ores fall into this water, they'll eat them. <laughs> I don't know what they'll do with trolls, but you know, we'll see. But uh, right now I've got leeches in my moat. So that that's different than what I've had before. But you'll see as I come across here, if I walk into this third rock, I start getting into the swampy area. And there's the leeches. Here's one that's coming up to me. See how it's starting to get dark, it's starting to rain. It's going to tell me I'm getting wet and I'm full on into the swamp now. But what I want to do is go venturing out into the swamp and doing a little bit more exploring. So and my tip for the day is if you're going to go to the swamp, the first time you go to the swamp, you know, unless you've got everything in the game, then you're ready to go with all the best weapons and the best armor and all that kind of stuff. I would suggest not landing in the swamp, <laughs> but certainly you can survive if you're ready to go to the swamp you can definitely survive the dark forest get yourself a place right there where the dark forest meets the swamp or maybe it's a meadows meets the swamp but that way you're kind of in a position where you're not trying to build a base inside the middle of there until you're ready for it because until you're ready for it it's a scary place in there and you know, I know as I get better and I get more equipment and I start decking myself out in iron plate mail, I'll be less afraid of being in here <laughs> or less squishy being in here. Maybe that's a better way to say it. Um, uh, but you know, there's pluses here. There's fish in the water. I can go fishing again, but yeah, there's lots of other things. Like I said, you've got leeches in the water. That's always fun. This is where we're at for now. I mean, uh, we'll see how this goes. It looks like it's getting dark, so we'll get up in the morning and we'll do a swamp run. And we'll go into the swamp and just kind of look at the critters that come after us. And at least now we've got a spawn point close by. If I do get killed, I can uh, get back in here, get my stuff. See if I can get up here. Oh no. Oh no. This is not good. This is really not good. Oh no, they poisoned me. Crud. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, I'm gonna die. Yep, I'm gonna die right here. There's, I'm dead. And that's what happens when you get out here and you start playing around and you haven't even eaten anything. So, all right, well, I'll respawn here in a second and uh, we'll sleep the night away after I get my stuff back and we'll go exploring the swamp. All right, a nice sunny day be able to get out there and wreak some havoc on these swamp critters give a little bit of payback first thing we got to make sure is we got a poison resistance mead that we made back at the farm so i'm ready to go out there without having to worry about getting poisoned by the leeches or by the bugs. the other thing i'm going to make sure is i got some good food to eat I got my turnip stew. I got some sausages that I picked up from the draggers that decided to come too close to my base over here. And I got some carrot soup. A little bit of meat too, so I'll make sure I've got plenty of stuff on me. I got my poison resistance mead on me. I've also got some medical mead and some stamina mead so that I can keep myself going while I'm out here. Okay, here we go. <laughs> here comes the leeches and I want to make sure I got it. there we go get that hoe out now I can do some leveling off this ground so I don't have to wade through the water all the time okay so we'll do a little leveling there you go come here leeches come here yeah come on come on come over here there you go come right over here because you know when you get on land that's so scary anymore are you here come on come on 
There's some more dirt for you. Isn't that fun? Yeah. Don't like that, do you? One good thing about the leeches when you get on the dry land, and they can bite you, but they don't poison you on dry land, so. Oop. <laughs> I'll be back for that tree later. I got it. Oh no, blob, blob. Ah, ah. I hate those things sneaking up behind me. Ah, get away, get away, get away. More poison resistance. Ah, give me some medical potions. Oh, he got me again. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Medical brew. There we go. All right, there he is. Uh, this hatchet is not going to do well. Oh, no, he's going to get me again. Ow. Uh, how about some meat? There you go. Have some mace. How about some mace right in the face? There you go. All right, well, see, poison resistance helps out a lot. <laughs> and it lasts about 10 minutes, so I should be good for a while. I'll be back for you later, Mr. Log. Get some ancient block off of you. Let's see. Can I already got some poison resistance meat on me, so I guess I can go through the loader a little bit. What I need to do is I gotta find these droggers. I got I, I know I need an elite drogger head. I gotta see where they might be out here in the swamp. I know there's some in the crypts, but there's also spawners out here. And if I can find a spawner, then I can maybe go after there's a drogger. Come here. Come here. Here. Yeah, I like it with a the shield. There you go. <laughs> yeah, payback, ain't it? All right, let's see. Um, which way did it come from? Um, all right, let's go out this way. Um, let's see. Get my hoe out. Figure out where I'm going. Oh, aha! Ruins. What's in here? Let's look over here. Give me a nest. That's what I need, a nest. I don't think there's anything in there. I uh, hear flies. Ah, ah, there it is. There's a dragon nest in there. That's what I'm looking for. All right, come on. Yeah, one star. Yeah, I got my shield now. Not climbing out of a boat this time. Oh, that got me that one. Okay, here, have some. Here, you, have some more. Yeah, this is gonna be easy. Just keep, come on, come on, come on. Keep coming. Come on. Ow, 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 archers. Oh, there's an elite. Come on. Block, block, block. Pounding. Yeah. There you go. Give me another one. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, okay, yeah, we'll get this thing. It won't take us long. Let's bash. Back up. Block. Smash again. Yeah. This is going to work. This is going to work. Come on, elite. Uh, just a regular one, probably. Uh, have I picked up anything yet? I uh, haven't seen anything. Uh, another one. All right. Oh, ow! Archers! Archers! Run! Nope. Lots of archers. Oh, no. Ow! 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 Okay. All right. Well, you're not so tough. You're not so tough. All right. Uh. Oh yeah, this is gonna be easy. You're not so tough. Ow! Oh, two star archer. Ah, get away! Get oh. That's embarrassing. All right, death run time. Get by my stuff. Probably should have eaten something before I came out here. I remember the rules. All right, there's my stuff. Get the heck out of here. I don't need to run into that guy when I haven't eaten. I think I'll flatten this out. little road out here. Okay. Get back up here. Okay. Put my stuff back on. All right. There. That feels better. That feels a lot better. All right. I'm probably not going to make this with an axe. Right. Cloak on. Yep. There we go. Bow's out. Where's that archer? Come here. Oh, no. Not fire arrows. I don't need fire arrows. They just put them out in the swamp. Everything's wet. Fire arrows don't do any good. Ow. All right. Where's it? Right, run away. Run away. Run away. Watch. Watch. Run away. Get out of here. No stamina. Okay. I lost him. 
I lost him. Oh no, he's done. Oh. Okay. Trio blocked me. I'll be alright. Aha, gotcha. Aha, I staggered you. Come on. Oh no, snow stamina. No. Oh. <sighs> okay. Run of shame again. Here we go. All right. At least it's not that far to get it. Okay, I got my stuff. All right. Oh, it feels better. Okay, let's get everything back on. Uh, okay. All right. Back in. Got. Yeah, that's right. But right that. Oh, so you can't hit me if I go from side to side, huh? All right. Okay, I can do this. I can go side to side. Come on. I can do this. I can get, I can get side to side, not run away. Think. Come on, you only think. All right, here we go. All right, we got him this time. Come here. Where'd you go? He's hiding. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Did I get them all? No way. Did I get them all? All dead. I don't think anybody's over there. Let's go see what I got. Did I get ahead? Did I get ahead? Oh. Oh no, they're still there. They're still there. Oh, ow. Come on. Dodge. Back and forth. Don't run away. Don't run away. Just dodge. 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 <sighs> Nowhere to dodge between trees. All right. Okay. I think I, think I got them. They're dead. They're dead. All of them are dead. I got one. I got it. 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 I got, it. I got the elite Draugr head. There it is. The hardest thing of this whole quest. Now I just need some more ancient bark. Got a little bit from that tree, and I need iron scraps to get into my iron ingots. All right. Okay. So <sighs> just got to wait around in here and get some muddy scrap piles. Pack them up. And I should be able to get enough iron for the iron sledge. Awesome. Right in here. Oh, there we go. There's a muddy scrap pile. Knock this thing out. Now give me some iron. Dead end. scrap piles I need to get the boxes they got stuff in them. they got more iron in them than these scrap piles but get every bit that I can get I need 30 just gotta get 30 iron ingots that's what he said right there we go. yep 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 all right Let's see nothing left there all right where else is there some iron gotta be some iron here somewhere Oh, there's how to get the bone mass. <laughs> I'm coming for you, bone mass. Let me get this stuff cleared out. I'm going to get my iron sledge of awesome. Oh, there's a chest. Iron in there. Iron in this other chest. Oh, that's junk. Well, some, yeah, some iron in here. All right, cool. And some gems. Right. Coming for you, bone mass. I have junk in this one. Oh, well. All right. worth taking right now leave the iron in there for now and collect some more here we go right on the other side of here oh lucy i'm home <sighs> tiring work tiring work okay Come there's another i see something on the other side here yep ah mushrooms come on that's not much. Room with some chests in it. More iron than this. I'm gonna have 30 iron ingots. Uh oh. I see the other side of this one. There's something over there. Let's go. Let's go. Get in there. That's right. Oh, I hear him. He's in there. Where's he at? Where 
is he at? I don't see him. Where'd he go? I don't know if he'll rest any longer, but I doesn't mind. I could take him out still. Just gotta make sure I don't get hung up in this crap pile. Here we go. Oh, you're stuck. Aww. <laughs> oh, well, I guess I'll just have to shoot you with my bow. There you go. All right, what else is in here? Clear this out. Anything else? Aha, another chest. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Now we're getting somewhere. More scrap piles. All right, let's take these out. See what else is in here. Don't need those mushrooms. Give me some more scrap piles. Let's go anywhere. Another dead end. Really? Oh, oh, maybe. No. Uh, more dead ends. More mushrooms. I need chests. I need to get some more. The chests are full of iron scraps. So I can get my ingots. What do we got over here? This is what kind of wear me out. I don't know how long my pick's going to last. See what good I can get. Oh, there's room over there. Got, got. Measures a weight on the other side. I can feel it. What's in here? <laughs> More scrap piles. Are you kidding me? <sighs> All right. Well, I just got to get what I got because my picks broke now. All right. Well, I got back to the base. I had enough to make 30 iron ingots. I found enough ancient tree bark to get my 10 ancient tree bark from their swamp. And I've got my elite Draugr head. I'm ready to go. Go back to Haldor. I'm going to get my stuff in there and get him to make me the iron sledge of awesome. I can't wait. There's home. At least a home. Right over here. This metal unloaded. And go see how long. I can do this uh, wrecking the boat. Alright, got everything. I have to leave the metal down here for now. It's too much for me to carry it all in one trip. Get the hall door. And get my sledge of awesome. Can't wait. Can't wait. Out of my way, everybody. I don't care about your deer. Don't care about your gray dwarves. Yes. Gotta go up here to Haldor. Haldor, dude, I got it. I got everything you asked for. I've got. Look, 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 I got. I got the Draugr head, I got the ancient wood, I got a bunch of metal right down the hill I gotta bring up here. I couldn't bring it all in one go, it's just too heavy, dude. I got everything, so, so let's get this party on the road here. Where's, where's, what I gotta do to get the sledge? I need to like give you my stag breaker and you're gonna turn it into this thing or what? No, no, no. You're only lacking one ingredient. What? I, I got everything. I got everything you told me to get. Hey, you wanted the head. I got the head. That was tough, dude. I mean, that was a lot of draggers I had to kill. And they, they kept killing me. I, I, but I got it. I got the head. I got the ancient tree bark. I've got all that metal down the bottom of the hill there. I just got to bring it up here because I need the sledge because I'm going into the swamp and I'm going to, I'm just going to blast those guys. The one thing you still need is you need four pieces of of the Ymir's flesh. What? All right, then wait a minute. Now, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You promised 
that if I got all this stuff and I brought it to you, that you would make the iron sledge of awesome. And, and now you're acting like, uh, I got the stuff for nothing. Calm down, Clarice. No, 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 no. You said, you said, I'll help you with the, no, no, no. Uh, you said you'd do it. And, and now I brought you what I need. I, I followed your five rules. I got everything out of the swamp I needed. And I'm here to get my sledge of awesome. And I, you're killing me here, man. You're killing me. Calm down, calm down, Linda. The name's Julie. Come on, just call me by my name. Yeah, yeah, right. Whatever, Christy. Listen, I know where to get the Ymir flesh, and it's closer than you think. I'd be willing to part with four pieces of Ymir flesh that I have in a box over there, waiting for just this time for a little bit of gold. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. Here we go. Fleece the new guy. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, I see how this works. So I go do all this work. I bring it back to you. And then you're going to rake me over the coals for some weird item. I'm not a wizard, Dorothy. I'm a merchant. I have what you need to craft the iron sledge. Maybe I should just go try to find Ymir's flesh somewhere else. Silly girly man, I, and I alone, am the person that you need to come to for your mirror's flesh. But seeing as you've done all this work, I'm going to offer you a special deal. I will only charge you 120 gold pieces for each piece of your mirror's flesh. I think that's a fair price, considering the work that you've done. A fair price? A fair price, right. And it's raining. Perfect. Perfect. Rain coming down and... Uh, where am I going to get all this gold from? I don't have any gold. I mean, I got some stuff I picked up from the grips that I was digging through to get the iron ore that you said you had to have to make this iron sledge of awesome. So, so what? Is this stuff worth anything? Hmm. Why don't you give me a look and we'll see. Enough for one. I think you've got enough. Now you just need to give me some of that gold. And you can be on your way. What do you mean on my way? Aren't you going to help me make the sledge and, and do all the cool stuff? Silly human. Listen, Linda. You had the power to make the sledge all along. All I did was give you the push in the right direction. You should be thanking me. If it wasn't for me, you'd still be naked and afraid. But now look at you, all ready to go fight the swamp creatures with just a big hammer. Dude, I'm, I'm, whatever. Just give me the Ymir flesh. Just, just let me buy this stuff and I'll go down and make the hammer. And I'm going to go back into the swamp and see if it does what you said it does. One, two, three, four. Wow, you took almost every piece of gold I had. All that work for the dungeons and you just, just swiped it away from me. I should have known. Thought you were here to help. I am here to help. Like I said, if it wasn't for me, you'd be wandering around in the dark, probably getting killed a bunch more time. Okay, Dorothy, you have what you need. Carry yourself back down to your little tower at the bottom of the hill and build your iron sledge of awesome. And when you see the things it can do and the power it has, come back and see. Maybe then you'll want to thank me for all the help I've given you. Instead of whining about having to do a little work. Now go. It's time for second breakfast. And I'm very hungry. Alright, fine, fine. But I'm going, alright? I'm gonna go down the hill. I'm gonna make... <sighs> I'm going to make this iron sledge. It better, better, better be the thing that you're telling me it's going to be because I'm going to be going out in the swamp and if it doesn't work, I'm really going to be in a bad situation. So I'll be back if it doesn't work. I'll be here. Always here. Yeah, whatever. All right, fine. I'm my your mirror flesh. I'm gone. I'm out of here. All that work. And I could have just done this. 
all by myself. But no, listen to him. Now I'm in the woods in the rain. Probably running from a troll somewhere. Uh, great, 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 great. All right. I got to get back to the base. I'm just going to go to bed. I needed. I need about 30 pieces of iron, 10 ancient bark, one elite trophy, four Ymir flesh. Shit. Oh, got ripped off. <sighs> okay. So depressing. Better be able to make this thing. Iron Sledge, two-handed, 100 durability, level two repair, 55 blunt. What is a stag breaker? 32, knock about 200. Stag breaker is 150. All right, let's get this thing made. Craft, boom. I have the power. Holy moly. Look at that. Oh, I broke my building. Sorry. I mean to. Ah, let's get some punch. All right. Look out swamp. Yuli's coming to get you. Oh, yeah. Should I say it? I gotta say it. It's hammer time. Yeah, how you like that? Want some? Want some? Put some more. Some more? Oh, you want some more? Come on. Boy, you me with that stuff. What that? Oh, where are you? Guess you won't be fighting nobody else, will you? Where's a blob? Show me a blob. Oh, there's somebody. Come over here, big boy. Well, bam! Put some more to this. You want some more? Here. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. One more. One more. One more. Yeah, break my boat. Oh, you gonna run away now? Come on. Take your medicine. Oh, a nest. And a nest is it? You're broken in a minute. Okay. Try that. Try some of this. Ow. Try that. What about this? Some of that. Oh, broke your nest. Now. Now what are you going to do? Gonna be a lot of sausages tonight. 
Eat some more food and then I'm gonna kick some more butt. Do that. Do that. Oh, blob time. Yep. Boy. Dead blob. Ah, sneak around behind me, won't you? You did too. Poison just in case. Poison resist. I remember what Haldor said. Poison resistance swamp. Come on over here. Got something for you. Get some more. Here. Here. Come on. Come, come back. No run. No run. thing oh yeah it's a crypt oh through the doorway for the win <laughs> yeah mess with me now Oh yeah, this is the thing to have. Just gonna say, you don't need to go to Haldor. You've got the power. Go to your inventory, into the forge. Look up how to build a sledge. You're gonna need Ymir's flesh from Haldor, but that's all you need from him. 30 iron ingots, 10 ancient wood, and you too can have the mighty Hammer of Awesomeness. Good luck to you in your search. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you being here. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. If you really had a good time, please hit that subscribe button. Make sure that if you do hit the subscribe button, that you also hit the bell so that you'll be notified every time I add a new video to the collection I've got going on the site. Thank you so much for watching. This is Julie signing out.